woman is now her accused killer. Seble Dietrich was last seen almost a year ago on July 10th. And police say that's the day Stefan Dietrich murdered her. CTV's Nicole Lampa is back from Guelph. Nicole, what do we know about her husband? Well, Megan, besides being charged with first degree murder, Stefan was also charged with obstructing police for allegedly lying to them when they began their missing persons investigation. Friends and neighbors say Stefan Dietrich was quiet. I know him uh, while he was coming to our church with Sebla. That's uh, her husband. Seble, also known as Mimi, was reported missing last July, and police considered her disappearance suspicious. It's been lengthy, uh, for sure, um, but they've, uh, at this point now, gathered enough evidence that they felt uh, the charge of first-degree murder was warranted. Stefan Dietrich appeared in court today in handcuffs, a yellow construction shirt, and jeans. He has a thick German accent and showed little emotion when the charges were read out loud. While Dietrich was at the courthouse, police were busy here at a home on Vancouver Drive. Neighbors say cruisers showed up yesterday afternoon. Police say this is where the Dietrichs live. Absolutely, it's a shock. It's, it's unheard of, right? Uh, your neighbor's charged with first-degree murder. Amy Ramsey lives across the street. She says the couple has three children. Those kids just lost everything they ever had. You know, their mom, their dad, everything. Ramsey says officers looked through the home last night. Today, officials in blue hazmat suits were seen looking near the garage. At this point, the body is still outstanding. Stefan Dietrich remains in custody. He has a video court appearance on July 17th. Megan.